Take everything out. We have a whole to-do list. Did you buy a new fridge? I hope we are not losing air. 7.52. I need a break. Uh, we're ready to tackle this. And take this window out. Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. We are Manasi and we've been traveling in our self-converted van parka for the past year. We are in Berlin at the moment where we are based and we had the luxury to take everything out. We have a whole to-do list to get parka ready for the road again because we are heading to Scandinavia. We want to have a very clean van, we want to have a very fit van and there's a long list so we can't wait to scratch things off the list and get ready for the road. Right now we parked outside the hardware store because it's a few things we need to get. So let's go shopping. But before we go into the hardware store, we actually have to measure some things because there are some adjustments happening here in Parker. So as always, taking the measurements of the windows because we're going to do a little cosmetic fix. So if you look from down here, you can see that we put some insulation foam in here and it doesn't look so nice so we're gonna cover it up and don't forget measure twice cut once <laughs> but this time the hardware store will cut for us somehow there's no such thing as a quick shopping in, in a hardware store always takes ages. Last time we were here we actually got a lot of extra coins because we knew we would be back and we would appreciate this and here we go. Now we have all of our washing coins and it's a moment right? Fill in the water that someone left before. Let's say recycling the water that someone left. today so I think we're gonna call it a day for now and continue tomorrow but at least Parky is looking brilliant in the outside nice and clean and I think it's smoothie time and chill for me because it's too hot and somehow oh. Bamba. <laughs> one more sorry I need a break oh. and that's <laughs> it <laughs> see you tomorrow it is the next day I'm feeling much stronger I had a good night's sleep we had breaking coffee we're ready to tackle this. Today, cleaning the inside has to be taken out of the list. So, we brought up proper vacuum. <laughs> Let's do it. It's good that we have an inverter in the van, so we can just use the vacuum. Off grid. <laughs> it's fridge time. I think it's been a while we cleaned this guy from the inside completely empty. Ah, uh, yeah. It's about time. It is about time. This is when you don't clean your fridge properly. But now it's time. It's gonna, it's gonna look like new. Yeah, man. Oh, yeah, this is what we're talking about. Just realize you can actually detach this. <laughs> Much better. Well, you can see on camera on the bottom, it's quite dirty. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Give me that. Did you buy a new fridge? I might have. <laughs> wow. Looks like new. Once we are back on the road and we take some shots on the road, the windows are clean again. And hopefully you can see a bit more when we shoot some scenes from inside of the van. Actually, since we are at it, is that better? So this was actually in theory our thought with the shower. Because now it's empty, we would just lift it up. And there we go, ready to shower. But we didn't think of, yeah, that we probably end up putting stuff on top. So now, as you know, probably we don't use the shower as often as we planned, but it's still there. Wow, good job, baby. This looks also like new. Well, this one will look like new soon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, actually, I don't know if you remember, but we broke our cooking okay. field. Induction field here is like a crack. I don't know if you can see it. And we already got a new one. And also, have you ever seen our junk basket that empty? 
It's amazing. Cleaning when nothing inside is just the best. It's so easy. But it's sometimes really difficult on the road to put all of your stuff out and uh, clean. Next project, we have to change this piece because what happened, I don't know why, with both windows, when we open them, first of all, they don't click into place anymore. And if you go out too much, those things fall out and then the window is just loose. So we have to change this piece and I hope it's as easy as we think. But most of the times it takes twice as much time as we think anyway, so we are prepared. For a second there we got scared that it doesn't fit, but it's actually not too bad. So It's not very clear how to <laughs> change, but we figure it out. But they wanted to send us a whole new window and we were like, we can't take this window out, it's already in, yeah. the, in the van. So yeah, they sent us the part. Okay, I'm a bit excited. Moment of truth. We changed the pieces and now let's see if it works. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro. And now when we open it, it should actually click into place. Let's see. Yes! That's it. That's okay, that's they, it. Okay. okay. It's not much, but it works again. Yes, that's nice. And back. Amazing. On the other side. Good job. Window number two. Should be fairly easy now because now we know it, how it works. Window number two is done. Let's see if it works as well. One, two, three, four. Wait, I have to look if there's a car coming. Woo, good job. Perfect. I'm looking for a high five. Oh, sorry. <laughs> good job, man. Sano decided to stay at home and do a little workout and I feel like going for a run. Somehow when it's raining, I always feel like running. So I'm gonna go for it. I don't know, I like to breathe this humid air. I don't know, it's weird, but I like it. See if Sandra's done as well. Still pumping? Still pumping. Go for it. Timo is currently teaching. I had a shower and I'm going solo on a mission to find a couple of things that are missing for the van. So, if you guys are ready, let's go. I made it to the shop. I actually have to be very strong because home stuff is my vice and Timo is not here to say no so it's dangerous but I found the little jars that I need for the kitchen for the spices so I got a few of those in here and now I'm looking for a couple of extra things that we need and I have to pick up a package and I have to go back because we have more cleaning ahead so see you in the van and here we are back at the van ready for more cleaning let's do it and this is the fixing we do here behind we have a bit of foam for insulation and we can actually see it from the bed so we decided to put a piece here's already one and we're gonna do the same on the other side and the cooker is out i cut my finger earlier timo almost lost his finger uh, what also, are you trying to do <laughs> I'm trying to get a knife out yeah, but i think it's not the, <laughs> the moment let's open the new one we hope it's the same one because actually it has a different packaging so we have bits uh, or i am a bit concerned that this is not the very same cooker because we made a custom made cut in our countertop but i think we're gonna see it in a minute moment of truth does it fit and it looks good like a glove we have a new guy in the house oh it looks nice yeah. so this is the new one and once again maybe the lighting is a bit better no, it is not. Here it's chipped and this is the corner where I cut myself earlier, so... That's it for today. Just some minor things left. Another day, another kaka koki momento. <laughs> it's time to make the toilet, clean and ready again. This time we got a different coconut soil and I'm gonna say, I love this guy. He's so much better. It's just... Uh, I think it's thinner maybe and it's just quicker, it hydrates better, it opens quicker. Love and that. So today I got my gloves on and it's happening. And I actually cleaned already down the toilet. We spare you the details. It's already one half of the coconut block and you see the toilet looks like new. It was time and now we're gonna get 
the toilet ready for departure once so again I, this is how it looks obviously i mean i already broke a little but they like dried and in little blocks so what you want to do is break it into pieces we use something pointy like a knife and then you just add some hot water and becomes that Ta -da! We're taking a little break from preparations and actually we got a little toy for our Norway Sweden trip and we're gonna test it out today here in Berlin at a lake. We got ourselves an inflatable kayak and we are super excited to try. It's time to bump. It's the first time we pump it and unfold it and see how it works. So <laughs> let's cross fingers, it's easy and good. Let's do it. Ten minutes later, it's all pumped up and ready to go. We are fascinated. It was very easy. Yeah, it's going to work. The boarding is still a mission. <laughs> it's the first Should time. Should I push you? Ooh. Have it in? Yeah, but be careful with your leggings. It goes deeper now. I think <laughs> next time it's better if the heavier person sits in the back. So me. Ooh. We are in. Okay, I think I have, you put, I have to put you aside for a little, guys. Because <laughs> Monito is doing all the work. Let's go to this island, please. It's working just fine. We still have air in the kayak and we are in the middle of the water. I hope we are not losing air. We'll see a bit. You see, but it's very nice. This is just epic. So good. So relaxing also. Right now, she might better. Cacao, coconut, power ball to give us some extra power. Honest, honestly don't. I should be the last. Pretty good, pretty easy. Now we just let it dry a little and let's see how the yeah, packing back. Unpacking, yeah, packing back, repacking goes. The van is a mess, but that's just reality of van life. The kayak was actually much easier than we expected. Now it's properly folded and he's gonna leave right here under the bench. You might think we built it just for it because it fits perfectly and you're right. So it's gonna be there and now we have to pack all the van up again because tomorrow we plan to leave Berlin early in the morning and you know you don't want to leave these kind of things for the last minute. So today's mission is to pack everything and be ready for the departure. And actually while I was editing this vlog I realized we didn't even tell you that Parky checked his biannual checkup. Yay! Actually, he needed two trials because the first time he failed, but that's okay. Just a minor adjustment. Let's pack. So you thought you got it made for Easy living, slipping out the back door But it's not what you made for And there's nothing that is too late for How's it going? Not too bad, a um, bit of a change of clothing, so I have to reorganize my own systems, but I'm feeling positive about it. Remember when we arrived that I said I'm excited to take everything out and pack it in again? Yeah, why? Well, I'm not anymore. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> so much stuff here flying around, guys. But I don't want to complain. We're going to make it nice and neat. And at the end, we're going to have very easy access to everything. This is how we like it. And the kitchen is still in progress. Monito's tackling it at the moment. How's it going? I would say quite good. A lot of open stuff. <laughs> but we'll make it. I don't know how people can actually live in a van without these clips. We because stole all of them from your mama. <laughs> we bought so many and I don't know. We always run out of them. They are absolute essential. Packing is almost done. We just have to find a parking spot for the car for the night. And the little painting touches need to be finished but the biggest part is already done up and down down and up it's all packed feels good we had a smoothie to recharge in the meantime probably catch you up tomorrow good morning shopping is checked 
We are all packed and ready to go. We only need in a coffee and we can hit the road. I don't know if we have time for coffee actually. We make time for coffee. As always, Gamba is stressed about the time. And I think that we can spare five minutes for a coffee. She says it's gonna take me 15. Let's. I let's said 10 15. <laughs> Definitely not five minutes. Because it's around the holidays and uh, I don't want to miss the ferry. So we stop the time. Can she make it in five minutes? I think. What yes. do you think? Leave it in the comment section below. Let's do it. Ready, set, go. Let's see how much barista is still in you. <laughs> Two minutes. And you didn't even start pumping the espresso. To make it a bit easier, I would be happy with a single shot. <laughs> you were gonna get a single <laughs> shot for five minutes. 90 seconds to go. The milk is not warm yet. And the espresso... Mm. I'm not gonna pump the milk. Ah, you just warm it up. Yeah. 40 seconds to go. Second espresso is on the way. You could also put the milk on the pot and <laughs> Yeah, but the bet was that you can make a coffee in less than five minutes yeah, or within five it. minutes. I didn't say less. In five minutes. Twenty seconds left. Three, two, one, and five minutes. <laughs> we're still not on your time either, so I think we're good. We are now 6.30 and counting. I think to my defense, I should have had all my equipment out already when we started the time because I had to take everything out. Do you really think you would have uh, made yeah. up two minutes? Life, everything counts. Milk is getting served. We are 7.45 and 7.52. I'm happy with that. Had to be 7. Alright, that's it guys. We have to hit the road and luckily, thanks to Sandra, we even can do it with a coffee. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching this week's vlog and we're gonna catch the ferry and go to the south of Sweden to make our way up to Oslo, Norway. Thank you guys for following along during this packing and doing this week with us and as always thank you for watching if you haven't already subscribe to our channel and like this video and see you guys on the road with a special goodbye today do you want to show them what's new in the team we show you now you can spot us on the road <laughs> bye bye, bye.